Morning everyone, how are you all? Hope you're fine. Today we're going to be talking about Pulsatilla. So, what is Pulsatilla? Pulsatilla is a plant that parts of the plant that grow above the ground are dried and used as medicine. Pulsatilla contains chemicals that might be able to fight pain and bacteria. Homeopathic medicine containing Pulsatilla have been used for centuries by people suffering from symptoms associated with common cold to relieve migraines, to trigger menstrual, and relieve melancholy. Pulsatilla also used tension, headaches, hyperactivity, trouble sleeping, insomnia, boils, asthma, and other lung diseases, earache, migraine, nerve pain, neurologia, general restlessness, disorders of the gastro- gastrointestinal, and disorders of the urinal tract. Facts about Pulsatilla. How often should you take it? To be sucked or chewed unless, uh, unless otherwise, one dose every two hours for the first six doses. Thereafter, take one dose hour when required. Stop with the improvement. Does it help with anxiety? Pulsatilla is a very useful remedy for children. Getting too warm, being in a stuffy room increases the f- increases anxiety. Fresh air and gentle exercise often brings release. Often is helped with Pulsatilla. Effectiveness? Pulsatilla opasque flower is strong effective for potential toxic angestic and, and sedative herb. It is included with the dis, dis, discussion because the experienced herbalist and neutropathic phys, physicians may recommend it for severe in, intractable pain and insomnia. What are the side effects of Pulsatilla? Fresh Pulsatilla plant is unsafe when it taken by mouth or applied to the skin. It is severe irritation anywhere it comes to contact with the body, such as the mouth, throat, digestive tract, urinary tract, and skin. It can also cause allergic reactions. Contact, contacting with the skin can cause a rash, inflammation, and itching. Inhaling the, inhaling the volatile oil can irritate the nose and eyes. There isn't enough information about the dried plant to know if it is safe or what the side effects may be. Thank you for listening. I hope you have learned something from my presentation. Bye!